The red giant approaching cosmic infamy, brace yourself for what may be one of the universe's most spectacular events. BJ, the well-known red supergiant star located in the Orion constellation, has caught the attention of astronomers worldwide with recent changes that might signal an impending supernova. Using the powerful James Webb Space Telescope, scientists have unveiled intriguing and perhaps ominous signs surrounding Betelgeuse. And now, renowned astrophysicists like Bree Hancock are highlighting the possibility of a catastrophic explosion, which could forever alter our view of the night sky. As we examine the life and current status of Bijou, we stand on the precipice of what might be a historic moment in astronomical observation, a supernova visible from Earth. For centuries, humans have gazed up at the night sky, recording supernovae as bright celestial events. Could Betelgeuse soon join this list? As one of the largest stars within our observational reach, this potential explosion would not only be mesmerizing to watch but also provide valuable insights into the end stages of a massive star's life. A colossal red giant nearing its end, Bijou is an enormous red supergiant star, one of the largest and brightest stars in our galaxy, and certainly a behemoth in size when compared to our sun, approximately 764 times larger. If Bijou were placed at the center of our solar system, it would extend past the orbit of Mars, engulfing Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars in its fiery expanse. This colossal size is a testament to its unique and advanced stage in the stellar life cycle. Red supergiants like Betelgeuse are among the last phases for massive stars, and Betelgeuse is thought to be about 8 to 8.5 million years old. While that might sound young compared to our sun's age, 4.6 billion years, it is quite advanced in stellar terms. Betelgeuse has spent most of its life fusing hydrogen into helium, a stage that is followed by a series of changes that produce heavier elements. Now, in its red supergiant phase, Betelgeuse has begun to fuse heavier elements, producing a characteristic reddish glow due to its cooler surface temperature, around 3,500 Kelvin, much cooler than our sun's 5,500 Kelvin. Betelgeuse's historical significance and evolutionary journey, for centuries, Betelgeuse has captured the interest of both astronomers and stargazers. Ancient Chinese and Roman records indicate that this star might not have always been red. Texts from 2,000 years ago describe Betelgeuse as yellow, suggesting a color change over human history. By the 10th century, Arabic scholars started referring to Betelgeuse as red, indicating a phase in its evolution. This color shift could mean that Betelgeuse has undergone significant transformations, shedding light on the dynamic life cycles of stars. Another intriguing feature of Bijou is its variability. Known as a semi-regular variable star, Bijou's brightness changes in a periodic fashion. Observers have recorded a 400-day cycle of dimming and brightening, accompanied by a longer five-year cycle. These cycles, first documented by Sir John Herschel in 1836 and possibly even earlier in indigenous oral traditions, show that Betelgeuse's light output is not constant. Such variability indicates that the star undergoes periodic changes in its surface and internal structure, hinting at complex processes occurring within this colossal star. However, what sets Bijou apart from many variable stars is its unpredictability. While its brightness waxes and wanes in cycles, it sometimes exhibits irregular changes that hint at deeper processes within. The most notable recent example was the Great Dimming event in late 2019. The Great Dimming is a prelude to a supernova. In late 2019, Betelgeuse shocked the astronomical community with a dramatic drop in brightness, dimming to an extent that was visible to the naked eye. The phenomenon, known as the Great Dimming, reached its lowest point in February 2020. Bijou lost an average of 0.01 magnitudes in brightness per day, a significant and rapid change for a star of its size and age. The dimming was so noticeable that even casual observers saw the difference in Orion's shoulder, where Betelgeuse is located. While scientists were initially puzzled, extensive observation has provided some insight. Andrea Dupree, associate director of the Center for Astrophysics at Harvard-Smithsonian, and her team monitored Betelgeuse using the Hubble Space Telescope. They found that the dimming was likely due to an enormous ejection of hot material from the star's surface, which formed a dust cloud that partially obscured Bijou's light. This mass loss event was monumental, with material moving at speeds of up to 200,000 miles per hour from the star's surface into its outer atmosphere, eventually cooling to form dust grains. This obscuration event and the unprecedented mass loss led to speculation that Bijou may be nearing the supernova phase. 
Challenges in monitoring Bijou, the time paradox, when we look at Betelgeuse, we're observing the star's light as it was approximately 750 years ago, because of the time it takes for light to travel that distance to Earth. This means that any current changes we observe are really events from the past. Such time delays make it challenging to predict Betelgeuse's next moves. Are the changes we see a direct prelude to a supernova or part of Betelgeuse's typical cycles? This time paradox is a common challenge in astronomical observation, adding a layer of complexity when monitoring distant stars. Astronomers can only make predictions based on models and prior knowledge, but these are always colored by the fact that the observations represent Bijou's ancient history, not its current state. A potentially imminent explosion, what happens if Bijou goes supernova? The future of Bijou remains uncertain. While its recent behavior suggests it is reaching the end of its life cycle, the timing of a supernova event is still speculative. If Bijou does explode, it would be one of the most spectacular and bright astronomical events witnessed by humanity. The light from a Betelgeuse supernova could potentially rival the brightness of the full moon and be visible even during daylight. Supernovae are among the most energetic explosions in the universe, releasing more energy in seconds than the sun will in its entire lifespan. Such an explosion would mark the end of Bijou as we know it, resulting in the formation of a neutron star or black hole, depending on the star's remaining mass. This explosion would emit an enormous amount of radiation, though given Bijou's distance from Earth, there would be no danger to life on our planet. Scientific Significance Betelgeuse as a laboratory for stellar evolution, the potential supernova of Bijou could significantly impact scientific understanding of stellar evolution and supernova mechanics. Observing a nearby supernova offers an unparalleled opportunity to study the intricate details of the end stages of a massive star's life. Data collected could lead to refinements in stellar models, particularly for red supergiants. Comparative studies, lessons from recent supernovae, the recent supernova SN2023X in the nearby Pinwheel Galaxy, Messier 101, has already provided critical insights into stellar death. Discovered in May 2023, SN2023X became a focal point for astronomical studies worldwide, as it was the closest supernova observed in recent years. Researchers documented the supernova's behavior, noting how it surged to peak brightness within days and gradually faded. This explosion showcased the dense shell of circumstellar material, providing clues about the final years of a massive star's life. Studying events like SN2023X gives astronomers a template for what to expect if Betelgeuse undergoes a similar fate. Analysis of SN2023X revealed a dense circumstellar shell that could affect the escape of the supernova shockwave, leading to rich interactions that can be observed with ground-based and space telescopes. If Betelgeuse experiences a supernova, it might produce similar characteristics, shedding light on the exact processes that precede such a cosmic event. The role of bow shocks and stellar winds, one aspect of Bijou's behavior that has fascinated scientists is its interaction with interstellar space. Moving at around 67,000 miles per hour relative to its surrounding medium, Bijou creates a bow shock, a wave of compressed gas and dust in its path. Studying this phenomenon helps researchers understand how stars lose mass and interact with their surroundings, further informing supernova theories. Implications for future supernova research Bijou is a unique case that could redefine how astronomers approach stellar death. The event of Bijou going supernova would open doors for real-time analysis, helping to refine our models of stellar structure, core collapse, and the formation of neutron stars or black holes. Understanding Bijou's evolution from its early stages as a hot blue star to its current red supergiant phase holds critical clues about similar stars throughout the galaxy.